Welcome, guys. We are so excited. It's Sam and Jason, and we are excited about the opportunity that we have to come and share a little information about what we see God doing and the future of our ministry coming for the spring and summer. Sam, what do we got going on continuing right now? Man, we've been so blessed to be able to start back our prayer breakfast, one of my favorite events. We eat Chick-fil-A in the morning mm -hmm. at uh, 6.45 we gather here on Wednesday morning, um, 6.45 to 7.30, and we eat, we fellowship, we have a good time of connection, and we have a devotional. Wednesday night at 6 to 7.30, we have our 2.11 worship, and we do some fun games, we, we go wild, we are socially distanced, we are masked, and we um, have a good time there too. So if you're looking for some places of connection there, those are the two things we've been having um, for the past couple of weeks now. And also, Sundays have always been our core groups. And we're still watching as our students are coming together and connecting in homes, also some here at the church. But we're excited because we're going to continue moving to, through those from 5 o'clock to 6.15 on Sunday nights. But we've also started a brand new connection called Mom's Connection. This is for some of our moms for our students and we're, it's being led by Julie Allen, and we're asking you to come and to join us Monday nights at 7 p.m. or Wednesday mornings at 10.30 a.m., both in the greenhouse. Please make sure you get you click the Get Connected that was in our e-blast and check in that. Sam, what are some of the upcoming things that we are praying and, and hoping that we're able to do in the near future? We're hoping to do some day outs, some mystery day outs. Yes. Um, I'm gonna kinda unveil this mystery a little bit. We were thinking paintball, paintball. because that's a place where you can be masked and you can have some fun shooting each other and so we were thinking that and then we have some other cool things planned out um, our summer camps yes. and we were so bummed last year when mm -hmm. we couldn't do anything over the summer this year we have the opportunity of being able to go to the beach and being able to do one of my favorite camps, Awanita, where you get to ride in a Humvee in the middle of the mountains and it's, it's ride horses I mean it's so much fun and so this summer um, dates will be posted pretty soon here, so you want to be on the lookout for that. You don't want to miss it. Also, we're continuing to move forward with other opportunities. Last year, our very last retreat that we had was our d -Now weekend. And so we are hoping as the COVID numbers are going down to be able to offer a different version of that, but I still have a d -Now weekend so that we can come, gather together, and really spend some time digging into the Word, but also having some pretty big events for our students. But one thing that we can definitely give you a date on is June 27th through the 30th is River of Life 2021. We are definitely going to be doing that this year, and other churches are going to join us. We've been able to watch and, and do some things that will safely distance us by allowing churches to stay, stay off location, but also gather together with their youth groups. And so we are excited to offer that to you. Parents, just know that we have been praying and trying to figure out the best way to continue to connect with our students. And that starts with you, and that starts with us working together to be able to be a part of this. So please make note that in the next couple of weeks, you're going to see some Zoom links that will be coming out with special invitations so that you can join us and ask the questions that you've been wanting to ask in order that we can answer those and also provide more information in the weeks to come. Thank you for being with us. Let's look forward to what God's going to be able to do in the spring and the summer. Thank you for being here.